Another day, another mid-state school district controversy. This time, an anti-bullying assembly canceled. In this case, the folks who got the speaker canceled are on the side that usually complains about cancel culture. Seth Kaplan, live with the story tonight. Seth. Dennis and Alicia, this is in Cumberland Valley School District. It took folks by surprise because of a big vote about an item that wasn't even on the agenda. Thank you for asking about that. The character Jonathan on the hit NBC show 30 Rock, played by Malik Pancholi, who is also the author of two books and was supposed to be a speaker at a Mountain View Middle School anti-bullying assembly. Pancholi's sister-in-law, Erin Corvea, who lives in the Cumberland Valley District of all places, explains Pancholi is several different minorities you'll find in schools here all in one person. He's Asian American, um, his family is Indian, and he's also grew up gay. Now by marriage, a part of Aaron's family. There he is on the left. There's Aaron's daughter, Flora, on the right several years ago. Now a student here where her uncle was supposed to speak until this. My motion is that uh, this author not be permitted to come to Cumberland Valley. That's board member Bud Schaffner, who elaborated using a term for gay that's now so many decades old that some of today's students might barely recognize it. Do we even have any idea what he's going to be talking about? I know he's a homosexual activist or what have you. And he is uh, proud of his lifestyle. And I don't think that should be imposed upon our students. Other board members expressed narrower reservations. Because it's scheduled to be during the instructional time of the day. But in the end... Mr. Barrick. Yes. Mr. Clancy. Yes. The board voted unanimously to cancel the speech. Trisha Comstock has two children in the district. You think he was canceled because why? Mr. Pancholi was canceled because he's gay. She says, sure, he's an activist, but for a cause the district claims to support. He is an anti-bullying activist. Um, there's no political agenda. There's no politics to it. She says the idea of being gay is a lifestyle choice rather than something someone is born like a race or ethnicity is as old as the term Schaffner used. That is the whole homophobic part of this is that it's not a lifestyle. And the concern about the assembly being during school hours. Every assembly is during school hours. That's the definition of an assembly that it's during school hours. The hardest thing for me is my daughter right now who's in the school and was excited for her uncle to be here and um, her friends were excited. She is struggling and, and I don't want her to think that this is the world that we live in. She is not just moping though. She's been qu coming quite an activist in her own right, launching a petition to let the assembly go on after all. Pancholi's speech was supposed to be this year's edition, Dennis, of an annual author speaking series. Seth, thanks so much.